Listen, babe, sorry to bother you, but my pay is short. The overtime shift that I worked, that we decided to work because we need the money, I didn't get paid for that. And she's like, oh, okay, I'll look into it. Yeah, please, I need the money. And that's all we have going on. You need my attention? I'm sorry. How's it going? Is everything okay? Yeah? Beautiful. I'm gonna just wrap up, okay? And then I'm all yours. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine? <laughs> okay, good. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Whenever I do these curls, they kind of give me Marilyn Monroe vibes. <laughs> I'm I'm really feeling it. But um I'm it's 5 p.m. It's 5:30 p.m. actually. I just called my job and when I called, my PCM answered. As in my manager from my floor, not <laughs> the manager in the office who's covering for the night or and she was like, "Hi, Mr. Jared, are you calling to call sick?" <laughs> And I'm just like, no, I'm just calling to confirm that I'm on the schedule for 3 South tonight. <laughs> She's like, yes, you're on for 3rd tonight. I'm actually going to keep you. But I thought you're calling to call sick because the other day somebody called me and it was a Friday night. And I know they weren't expecting to hear me. And I'm just like, yes, you got the wrong one, huh? <laughs> it was so funny. So, um... She said, I'm, I'm staying for tonight. She confirmed me for tonight and for my floor tonight. And she also um, switched a day for me for two weeks from now that I wanted to get switched. So that's perfect because I had I had ended up. Honey, honey. Hi. Hi. We good? Yeah, OK. I had ended up texting her um, about the day and she just hadn't gotten to it yet. So now that she's actually in the office, it is just perfect because she's able to swap it out right in the office, <laughs> right in the office and it's fine. So I'm not going to have to worry about calling out in two weeks or anything like that. So that works out perfectly <laughs> because that day her dad has something with his job where he has to go in by 7 a.m. So, um, you know, we had to move things around a little bit to make um, both our schedules work for each other. I went through, I went through and I blended this 24 ounce, oh, this 24 ounce bottle of smoothie from Mia. This is just pure fruits and a little bit of water. For a second I thought about putting, um, her um, thawed breast milk inside of the smoothie. And I'm like, no, I don't want to put it yet because whenever I'm making her a little bowl to give it to her, I could just add the breast milk if I wanted to and just, you know, whisk it around a little bit. So this is pure fruit. This is one banana. Uh, one banana, apples and one pear. I think maybe four apples and one pear and just the smallest bit of water. So this is the most organic that this smoothie could get. Later on, before I go to work, her aunt is watching her tonight. Also, um, you know, or nanny that we love so much. She's been with us for... Oh, wow. She's been with us for at least four months at this point. By the time she leaves, it's going to be four months. You know, she let me know that she has something that she does in the daytime. And, you know, she's going to pick up something different. And so she's not going to be able to uh be with us anymore and i'm so so very heartbroken so i have to communicate that with her dad i took a screenshot and i sent him ah, 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 ah. and i sent him but he hasn't responded yet because of work and everything so we're gonna have to talk about that and we're probably gonna have to hop on care.com and find somebody somebody that is um you know able to work for us and i want to get somebody that is also flexible for the daytime because a lot of times i could pick up overtime during the daytime and i don't have to sacrifice any of my um days off to do that but i can't because you know i have to be here um in the daytime because her dad works in the daytime with her so if we find somebody that has some flexibility for the daytime too that is absolutely perfect so we are gonna check that out and we're gonna see if we can find somebody um so far so far, I've gone through care and like carded a few people that I've seen in life. But the other day, her dad uh, 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 did mention somebody that he's known for a while. 
maybe like from his childhood and um to see um if she could potentially work but we're gonna have to communicate about that maybe tomorrow morning because by the time i leave here tonight he's not gonna get home yet so we're probably gonna have to talk about that tomorrow morning and see how that goes but it's so so sad because i love her nanny for her and she's already used to her and oh getting used to somebody new is gonna be something so i'm hoping you know it's not bad i'm probably gonna have to I don't know how I'm gonna how I'm gonna integrate her. Maybe I'm gonna have to do it for a day where I am home and I have like a lot of errands to run and see how she does with that. I don't know, we'll have to see. Um, but yeah, before we transition into the night, thankfully by the time I leave here and by the time her dad gets here, it's not like anything long. So we should be fine either way. But I do want her to get used to somebody and like be comfortable with them. And hopefully this person can stay with us long term for the duration of the time that we are gonna need a nanny for. So we'll see how that goes. But um, yeah, that's all we have going on. You need my attention? I'm sorry. How's it going? Is everything okay? Yeah? Beautiful. I'm going to just wrap up, okay? And then I'm all yours. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine? Okay, good. Um, I'm gonna go through. I just remember that some of my lashes were falling off, so I'm gonna go through. Let me sh let me give you guys a, a little close up. There, this eye is kind of naked, a little bit, and this one some came off. So I'm gonna go through, fix that, put my hair um back up, and then I'm also going to. I wanted to try and see if I can edit a video really quickly. I have 30 minutes. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that, but we're gonna try. And then I'm gonna go through and um. Fix the lashes, shower, go to sleep. Because it's going to be 6 p.m. by the time I'm done. Go to sleep, sleep for three hours, and then it's going to be time for me to wake up to start getting ready for work. So, so far, sounds like I have it all figured out. Is it going to go exactly how I planned it? I don't really know. We're going to have to just go ahead and see. But that's all I have for you guys right now. I will pick you guys back up tomorrow or so. Tomorrow? Yeah, maybe tomorrow. Okay, bye. Hi, guys. I have such an incredibly full day today. It's not even funny. I did so much. Clean up, do this, do that, yada, yada, yada. Looking for my camera because I can't find it. I just, maybe a few minutes, a few seconds before I picked up the camera, decided that I'm gonna reduce my coffee consumption. I might only be hurting myself because since I've worked my job, I'm used to either taking some coffee with me at night or buying some. In the new year, we're not trying to spend too much money where we don't have to because I'm gonna buy groceries um, either tomorrow or so. So we're not trying to spend money where we don't have to. I cook and I don't take food with me at night because I eat before I leave here. But I, you know, cook to make sure that I have home cooked meals that I can eat. And there's always something in the fridge. So I don't have to worry about that. I can't remember if I took my vitamins today. What did I eat this morning? I don't even know. Anyways, you know, just a busy day all around. I'm cutting my coffee consumption so I can drink, come home and drink coffee in the morning and be completely fine and not have to worry about drinking it at night and drinking it in the mornings too. We're trying to create healthy habits here, starting with saving more money, cutting down on coffee. You know, today we got paid. The pay is short and I'm expecting a certain amount and the pay is short and I'm era. Irritated, okay? Very irritated, but I, I texted my manager and I'm like, listen, babe, sorry to bother you. Obviously, I didn't say this. Listen, babe, sorry to bother you, but my pay is short. The overtime shift that I worked, that we decided to work because we need the money, I didn't get paid for that. And she's like, oh, okay, I'll look into it. Yeah, please. We need the money. We need the money. I have two babies to feed. And one of them... Just texted me and asked me to top her up with some money. <laughs> Come on. Come on, girl. <laughs> Guys, I gotta go to half time. It's 9.14. The nanny comes in another 10 or 15 minutes here. Mia is laying down on a bed. I have to go. See you guys later.